Okay, so let me tell you that I was completely wrong when I said that the Moon Man mod for Doom was the most controversial Doom mod ever made. Reading up the comment section of that video literally opened my eyes that there are way too many Doom mods that are all way more controversial than Moon Man. I'm going to make a video in every single controversial Doom mod, so be sure to- oh no, 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 the like button. The only reason why my H Doom review is getting so many views views recently is because it's almost at 5,000 likes. So, <laughs> so yeah, part 2 is coming soon. Lol. Anyways, move the, move the, move the, move the, move the like button. Ugh. So, I present to you my Spartan, one of the most, if not the most controversial, vile, disgusting, and just plain evil mod for Doom. And I love it so much. And <laughs> great so too. Oh, when is it at midnight? You are telling me you like killing senior citizens, grandparents, and religious people? <laughs> well, yeah, it's a game, and it should be treated as such a video game that will never be real. The point of this game is that it literally gets to a point that the game pretty much is self-aware that everything it does and shows it's just plain ridiculous. Like, if you're a person that knows how to separate fiction from reality then you're going to have a fantastic time playing this game. But watching Gretzi 2 now I know that pretty much conservative parents in the world think that all video games are like Gretzi 2 and that's why they don't want their kids to play video games because all video games are like Gretzo 2, vile, disgusting, and evil. But okay, Gretzo 2, the game, and I'm calling it game because even though it is a mod for Doom 2, the file size is almost 3 gigabytes, and rightfully so. It has loads and loads of weapons, so many different sprites, and the levels are just humongously big in size and also the levels. You also have different game modes you can play, one that is pretty much survival firefight in which you are inside a church and need to survive for 10 waves, giving us tons of different weapons every time you restart the mode. Like every single run of this mode has different weapons, always. <laughs> and it's amazing. The final boss of this mode is literally Jesus Christ himself. I do not know what is up with the soundtrack of this game, but the electro-religious remix is pure fire. You also have a type of deathmatch free-for-all in which you go against some indestructible bosses and some wild NPCs. Like, I literally tried everything in my power to try and beat those bosses, but nothing I did seemed to work against them. They are pretty much indestructible. Let me also tell you when playing this game you should lower the sound of it, because the game has loads and loads of different sound effects and dialogues at the same time, and it can get a little overwhelming sometimes. The game also has like a type of open world game mode in which you can pretty much do anything and everything you want. I know that this game shouldn't be taken seriously in terms of logic, but why in the heavens are weapons lying on the ground normally? Like, is this some type of GTA? Well, if you go to the display menu on the game and you go to the almost the highest display option, a GTA bar, weapon, health, and stars from police will appear in the top right corner. So, this game is pretty much GTA uh, Doom 2, literally. And I love it. You can do anything you want, kill some NPCs, wait for the police to show up, and do an ultimate standoff. And in higher difficulties, it gets overwhelmingly grotesque and difficult. And last but not least, story mode. The story of this game is quite simple. You're a man that for some reason has a huge grudge against religious people and with life in general. You go to a platinum wedding on a church and start killing everyone on sight. Priests, brothers and sisters, senior citizens, and religious people overall. When you kill everyone on sight, Jesus Christ himself or like an avatar, will go down to earth to finish you off. You then transform into some type of demon and finish his avatar off. You then go back to your house and you are visited by the religious mafia. They manage to kill you off and then you go to heaven to receive judgment from God. God, knowing that you're an actual piece of shit, 
kills you and sends you to hell. You then respawn on hell and your objective is to go back to your house so that you can use the hammer of boredom for yourself. This mod was made specifically for Italian people. 99% of the game is referenced in Italian culture and most of the jokes would be way funnier if I actually understand Italian. But meh. Whatever, that doesn't limit me on having way too much fun with this game. Even though this is a specifically Doom 2 mod, it honestly feels like its own game. There are dozens upon dozens of weapons and honestly, I know that I didn't get the chance to use them all. But yeah, this is not a game you want to show your parents because if you show this game to your parents, even though you are 22 years old like me, they will pretty much tell you to stop playing video games because they are they are bad for your mind, your soul, your health and your brain. So do not do it Spartans, just play this game in the corner, in the darkest corner of your room, literally. But yes, even though this game is highly controversial, I said that this game should be treated as a game as a video game, something that is not fiction. The good and fun part of this game is that it's plain ridiculous. And talking about gameplay mechanics, the movement of your character, how you feel when you move is pretty good. The weapons, they're pretty much immensely fun to use. You have weapons from Duke Nukem, I think that from Quake, from Doom, and some weapons from other games that I do not uh, recognize. But yes, the weapons are very very good to use. You can use the BFG 9000 from Doom 64. That is, I, oh, it's it's pretty it's pretty something. You can use hammers, pistols, assault rifles, light machine guns, chainsaw, like a saw but for wood. Uh, you can use any single type and every single type of weapon you can imagine in this game. My favorite game mode is the one from the church, the one that is pretty much survival firefight because I can use, I can get to use a lot of weapons at the same time and because it has my favorite song on it a religious remix of Italian thinking it's pretty good <laughs> but yes as always I recorded my first reaction to this game so enjoy the cringe because it's it's really something it's really something this game is intended for mature and responsible audiences Okay, this is a good way to start the mod. Okay, so right off the bat, I cannot show this type of imagery on YouTube, and I can see comments in the comment section, Oh, Midnight, you're being such a little silly boy. Why aren't you showing this gory stuff on YouTube? Well, because, first of all, if I show this gory stuff, my video is going to get age-restricted and demonetized, and that pretty much makes my channel go to the sewer for YouTube, literally. YouTube works so weirdly with videos, so pretty much, if, you're, if one video video gets age restricted, your whole channel is killed by YouTube, your new videos will not be recommended on the, on the, on the site, and uh, yeah, that's it, so stop it. <laughs> I can play alone, play with bodies, horse, I think those are the settings, uh, okay, play alone, learn to play, no, story mode, ecking random levels, big god in Perugia, game is without borders. Well, first of all, I think I want games without borders. Okay, let's do this one. I think these are the... Okay, difficulty. It, it crap. Let's do it. <coughs> oh my god, what is that? Is that a, like a shark with... What the hell? Someone... <laughs> what is this? Oh, I got a shotgun. Oh, what is that? What? You were fragged by Tiberia Team Petty. Why it's fragged? Am I playing multiplayer? Does this have an online mode? No, I saw him behind me! I picked up something! Missile launcher! <laughs> you were fragged by Bruno Vespa. Bruno Bucerati. By my understanding, this doesn't have like a multiplayer online mode, so I think these are NPCs. What the hell? Fragged by Bruno Vespa. Yeah, I do not think those are real gamer tags, so... I think these are NPCs, but... Okay, let's try hard something. A little bit. No! <laughs> No, don't kill me! Don't die! You piece of baby crap! There you go. Double kill! I have a kill streak. Triple kill! Triple kill! And I didn't get a triple kill. Is that a revenant? What the hell? Oh, this shotgun looks actually powerful. Let's see. Come here, baby. Thank you very much. Where where are the frags? Oh, ooh! One shot shotgun! Baby! Come on, I need some. No, I don't want the Tommy gun. I do not know if the songs here in the game are actually copyrighted, so... And I got killed by a an AI. Seriously. An AK-47? What the hell? 
what the hell is happening? Praise Jesus our sin and eternal Lord, man like us but God maker of all things. What the heck is in your mind, they're pebbles of River Tiber. <laughs> okay Spartans, I had to lower the music volume because those are copyrighted songs and I do not want any problem with YouTube because I don't want strengths on my channel. Oh, what the hell was that? Oh, I can get the middle finger. Take that. No, stop it. This is so, but so bloody. Like, what the hell? I am killing women, men, grandparents, citizens. I'm killing my priests. Like, what the hell? This is the, this is the house of God, and I'm doing these vile things here. I love it so much. <gasps> Paint stripper? What? Is it triple barrel shotgun? The Doomslayer would love this type of shotgun, literally. Boom! <laughs> it's so powerful! Die! Die! Okay, I need to stop being so filthy, but I cannot... Oh, This triple barrel shotgun is actually very, very cool. What weapon do I have more? Tommy gun, fl flamethrower. Is that it? Come on, people! Try to kill me! Kamehameha? Come come ah, and I killed myself. <laughs> the blood is rushing from my veins. I need to kill and kill more and kill more. <laughs> A rocket launcher appear on the altar. Oh my goodness! No! Ah! <laughs> oh, this is actually very powerful. Die, you priests! Are they sending crucifixes to me? What the hell is happening here? There's so much blood I cannot even see. What the- Oh no! YouTube demonetization, literally! I can already feel- I can already feel the yellow icon on my screen. On my analytics on my YouTube page, literally. <laughs> is this Jesus? I cannot see anything. I do not know what is happening, but I just need- I just need to kill Jesus Christ Torino. How do I transform into a demon? I didn't pick up anything. My goodness. The sound is overwhelming my ears. Like, it sounds like it's screeching on my eyes. Wait, did he die? What was that? So good, now you can go home. What a hecking mess, losing your own crap at your grandparents' silver wedding and killing everybody was amazing, but now you are chased by the cops, hidden in a shabby student's flat in the center of town. You spend days drinking like a, you know, as your memory fade away, and now you woke up in your bed, in your bed near to a... and... girl, at least it seems you have put your... And something. Your housemates left you all alone, but who cares? It's Christmas! <laughs> My goodness, really? Just wait a minute, where did they came from? Because they came from here, but the window is closed and there's no other door, so this doesn't make any sense. Oh no, more, more priests! Stop! Sending me your crucifixes! Where to go this door? Let's go. What? Why did I die? If you got a sudden heart attack, you died like a little baby. Okay, so I think I'm now going to heaven. <laughs> I don't know Italian, but I did understand this, that word, really. Okay, now I got a super shotgun of some sort. And. I guess... where do I go? You have to reach the mountain top to being judged by God. <clears throat> okay, let's do it. Oh! More priests! With more weapons! Who would have thought? Die! <laughs> Stop sending crew- oh my god, the pellets on the shotgun looked amazing. Too much people, got them asleep everywhere to avoid the queue. Okay. My god. Why? Am I an angel? Why can I fly? I do not understand, but this is the most epic fight ever. Oh, no. Come on. No! Oh, 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 oh. I'll kill you. 
No! What is even happening? I cannot understand what is happening. Oh my god. Okay, Spartans, please let me know what you think about this video. Leave a like if you did and leave a dislike if you didn't. Obviously, I like this mod, but I can see if some people are going to be highly triggered by... The, the, the person that do that did this mod. And not forget to follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and on Twitch. Join the Discord server. You will not regret it. And okay, Spartans. Okay, Spartans. That is all for today. If you guys liked the video, slap a like on it. I will greatly appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye bye. Take care. And I love you very, very much. Thank you for watching, Spartans. I really appreciate it. Bye bye. Mwah.